Alright, we are to our last and final episode in this horror um, series called the Tartarus Engine. Hoping I said that right. Um, hopefully it's a little bit more, you know, engaging than the last one. I really wasn't fond of the battleship. The idea was a great one, don't get me wrong, but not my cup of tea. So, we're going to dive into this one really quick and we're going to see where this goes. Beneath Hades as heaven is above Earth, construction began on the foundation of a great computer. Decades later, the first reality of eternal torment was an imitated, uh, imitated by the machine. The year is 2009. Well, we're a little bit past that, but okay. The year is 2009, and the Tartarus engine has been created. Time passed. To prevent workers from exploiting the machine for their personal gain, Multiple protective measures were set in place. Four technicians devised a plan and executed it into the night. There is no such thing as absolute security. Execute. Let's go. Willing to bet I didn't even hear me on that one. game's beginning, no Russian. I've got the piece. We are descending. We're looking for a partition 11, I believe. Wow, this is a little bit more uh, in-depth and detailed than last time. Can't go that way.
much. Yeah, let's go. What am I supposed to do? I'm probably going to have to redo this because damn. What the ever living fluff?
I'm at a loss. I definitely ain't gonna make it. sucked. I don't think I made it. I'm wondering if I actually beat it in time. I didn't see the crowbar originally. I had to cheat and actually uh, look it up. I totally did not see the crowbar because it stood out with everything. Harper, we are about to calibrate the device in a moment. There is a much time left. Strap yourself in. Oh damn, okay. So here we go. Strapping ourselves in. We're jacking I into the matrix! Set up. Which brace are you wearing? The one where you feel potatoes. Splendid. 
Don't worry, it's just for a moment. I'll pull you out as soon as I get my middle readings. Alright, see you in a bit. Oh no! Oh no! It's blowing us out! It's blowing us out layer by layer! What the hell did you do? How many layers deep are we? Damn! It's like Hellraiser! Engine, an unsorted horror exclusive created by Mike Klubinka. All right, interesting horror experience. I guess they, the the three of those guys, got warped into infinity, being um, subjected to being pulled in and out of the. I'm guessing a virtual reality. I got really stuck for the getting the, you know, once we're out there to uh, partition 11. I didn't see the crowbar because it blended in so dang well. So I had to cheat and go on uh, YouTube in order to find out, like, what am I missing? What am I not doing? It's, it's something as simple as that. I wish it had been something that would stood out more. But then again, maybe it was meant to, you know be something that complements the environment, rusted, old, and whatnot, but interesting premise, um, but frustrating to execute through the use of, like I said, the crowbar is what held me back. I'm assuming uh, that's the only ending. It's kind of a Hellraiser-ish uh, type of ending where it's like you're forever being ripped apart by this engine. So, yeah, that, that includes this, uh, this series of horror um, collection. Not a bad little series, uh, little short tales. I like short tales versus long ones. So, uh, my least favorite is obviously the Battleship one. Uh, that, I'm just shaking my head right now just thinking about it. Um, the other side was my favorite. That was a twist that I thought was uh, very unique. And but beyond that, not much else to uh, yay or nay on this. So, nay. Ha. <laughs> um, gonna conclude it here. 
thank you for following me along with me on this little uh, this little journey frustrating and as boring as it is at por our portions uh, so for now I'm going to let you go uh, you can find this collection on Steam if you want to try it beyond that I have uh, really nothing more to say so I'll see you all in the next uh, video cheers <laughs>